I won't be doing it again. Lad, you there? Quinn? Where are you? Getting me arse out of Dodge. Burke's had enough, and he's gunning for you. And I don't intend on being caught in the bloody crossfire. But listen, that trick you pulled with the gas. Fucking brilliant work that was. Head to me shop. I left you a thing or two so you can give him hell. I'd like to say we'd meet again over a pint sometime, but... Well, Godspeed, mate. Can't you recruit you, Jensen? She used Reed as a carrot.
between admiration and pity. You've condemned me for my actions, Jensen. But look at the lengths you've gone to to find one woman. Wasted potential. Although from what I've heard, I suspect you'll still be of use to me dead. I thought possibly to recruit you, but I see now you would never dare make a good soldier.
sounds like your struggles are almost over, Bratan. Is Brock dead? I'm standing, he's not. Let's just leave it at that. Oh, you don't make things easy, do you? Still, with Burk out of the picture even briefly, as a power vacuum I can use, the return to Loading Bay 2, the doors between here and the docking platform will be open for you. Last time I passed through there, Burke's men were still waiting for me. Not anymore. Burk has just ordered them away. Great. Except I came here looking for Megan Reed, Bratan. I can't leave without knowing. There is a boat heading toward the location as we speak. If you hurry, you can be on it. Bratan. Quinn? I'm afraid our good friend Quinn met with an unfortunate uh, incident during all the commotion and is no longer with us. Your voice. It was you this whole time. Who are you? For the moment, I'm between identities. I apologize for the duplicity, but it was a necessary precaution. You had to be kept in the dark. And Keitner? Did she know? Commander Keitner's perception was much like yours. Shrouded. She saw what she needed to see, and was told what she needed to hear in order for me to complete the mission. So we were both pawns. Except she's dead and I'm not. So where does that leave me in your grand design? We are all pawns in someone else's grand design, Mr. Jensen. But that doesn't make Natanya's death any less tragic. Your actions ensured her sacrifice was not made in vain, however. Dr. Kavanaugh made it out safely, and is on her way to the rendezvous site. She will expose the truth in due time. And the prisoners? Ah, yes. The prisoners. With Kavanaugh out, it's only a matter of time before this base makes international headlines. Until that time, however, I cannot say what Bell Tower will do next. I only know that a cornered and desperate bull is a very dangerous beast. We mustn't stay here much longer, Mr. Jensen, if we hope to get you away from this base. I still have questions, Quinn, and I want answers. Real answers. No more bullshit. You really want to waste time chatting, Bratan? Fine. I will answer what I can, but keep in mind... Floor. You're sure Megan is at this other facility? Nothing is ever certain in life, Mr. Jensen. But it is the best chance you have. Unfortunately, the cargo ship carrying the prisoners has already set sail. But I took the liberty to send out an urgent dispatch in Burke's name ordering the ship's captain to hold position until one more detainee could be flown on board. In stasis. A helicopter is en route to pick you up. Wait a second. You want me to get inside another stasis pod? Last time I got in one of those things, it didn't go so well. I know it's far from ideal, but frankly, your options are quite limited. Although, I suppose you could try swimming there. Better be the right fucking boat this time. Because I don't feel like coming back here anytime soon. Don't worry, man. It'll be grand. Besides, I thought you Americans liked riding off into the sunset. It's done. Exactly as you instructed. And yet you sound disappointed. You think we should have handled this differently? I think we had a valuable asset in our hands, and we're letting him slip away. He could have been very useful in the coming storm. A hand does not need to be clutched tightly to maintain its hold on someone. Jensen carries too much baggage right now. His obsession with Reed only serves to distract him. We could have told him the truth. He must discover it by himself. And when he does, if you have followed my instructions precisely, we will know how to find him. Assuming he lives that long. <laughs>